The peregrine falcon, also known as Falco peregrinus, is really famous for its remarkable speed, agility, and, well, stealth. Its Latin name actually translates to wandering sickle, which is a nod to the bird's sharply curved wings that allow for those swift, silent dives on prey. Native to Israel and the surrounding regions, the peregrine falcon is even trained by falconers across the Middle East for hunting, and, interestingly enough, it serves as the national bird of the United Arab Emirates. The B-2 bomber's unique flying wing structure, with no tail and a smooth curved form, actually draws directly from the aerodynamic profile of this bird of prey. This design really helps minimize drag and radar signature, which allows the B-2 to slip undetected through hostile airspace. The bomber's radar signature is so reduced that on enemy screens it can appear as little more than a small bird. During the recent Operation Midnight Hammer, seven B-2S participated in the strike, releasing 14 massive ordnance penetrator bombs on Iranian nuclear sites at Fordo and Natanz. Another facility at Isfahan was targeted by Tomahawk missiles launched from United States submarines. This operation really underscored the bomber's strategic importance and the success of its biomimetic design in modern warfare. Key to the B-2's stealth is its composite skin, which absorbs radar waves and the placement of its four general electric engines buried within the wing to reduce both noise and heat emissions. This combination makes infrared and radar detection extremely difficult. Flying with a smooth, tailless wing actually requires constant millisecond adjustments to maintain stability, much like a falcon's nervous system adjusts instantaneously during high-speed dives and sudden maneuvers. The B-2's impressive unrefueled range of up to 11,000 kilometers allows it to reach targets deep inside enemy territory and return without landing, and with aerial refueling, this range can be more than doubled. This incredible aircraft stands as a powerful example of biomimicry, where human innovation learns and borrows from nature's perfected solutions. Next time you see a peregrine falcon soaring high or diving swiftly, remember that this majestic bird has shaped one of the most advanced pieces of military technology in history. During Operation Midnight Hammer, 7B2S participated, releasing 14 massive ordnance penetrator bombs on Fordow and two on Natanz. A third facility at Isfahan was hit by Tomahawk missiles launched from US submarines. With just a single glance at the B-2's unusual form, a tailless, flying wing structure with no distinct fuselage, you can really see its avian inspiration. Just as the peregrine falcon dives silently on its prey, the B-2's smooth aerodynamic profile allows it to slip through the sky with, well, minimal drag, enhanced speed, and improved fuel economy. Thanks to biomimicry, that is, the imitation of nature, the B-2 can almost vanish from radar screens. Its shape, along with whisper-quiet gliding stealthy altitude adjustments, and honestly the precise spatial control borrowed from the Falcon's own aerial agility, gives it perfect camouflage and an exceptional unrefueled range of up to 11,000 kilometers. And with aerial refueling, that range can more than double, allowing the bomber to strike Iran and return without even landing. The B-2's outer skin is made of radar-absorbing materials, and its rounded structure prevents sharp radar echoes. The result is, well, a radar signature as small as that of a bird. Unlike conventional jets, the B-2's four general electric engines are buried within its body, cutting noise and masking thermal emissions, making infrared detection extremely difficult. Its smooth flying wing without a tail delivers uniform airflow, similar to a raptor gliding slowly but requires millisecond digital adjustments, much like a bird's nervous system during sudden maneuvers. So, next time you spot a bird of prey soaring overhead, remember, even the world's most advanced military technology can trace its origins back to the wisdom of nature.